Good evening, everyone. Um, really glad you guys are here today. Uh, we're excited for another day to have Corey and Dana with us. And um, we're going to go ahead and start with worship. Dana's leading our worship today. And um, we're excited to see what God will continue to do. It was an awesome time last night. The kids had a great time. Um, and I bet even the, the parents did enjoy the time as well. So let's uh, bow our, head, our heads for a few seconds just to ask God to bless this time and just open our hearts for what he has for us today. Dear Heavenly Father, we want to thank you for this day. We want to thank you because you're faithful to finish the work that you started. God, we ask your presence. Holy Spirit, you are welcome here. We pray that you would come and be in this place, Lord. We pray that our worship would be pleasant to you, Lord. God, we ask that you would uh, work in our hearts and open our hearts, ears, and eyes to see you. And uh, just lead us into your presence, Lord. Lead us into your presence. In your name we pray. Amen. Invite everybody to stand if you want. That'd be great. Jesus, we just invite your presence today. Holy Spirit, we invite your presence. And God, we ask that you would supernaturally encounter our hearts. God, we bring everything we are to your throne even now. Everything we have, all of our mistakes, failures, everything that we are, we bring to you, Jesus. God, we thank you for your mercy and for your grace. God, we thank you that your mercies are new every morning, God, and that we can come boldly before your throne even now, fully clean by the blood of the Lamb. God, thank you for the blood. Like a rain 
falls down on me. Yeah. Hallelujah, all my stains are washed away. That taught my heart to fear And grace my fears relieved And how precious did that grace appear The hour I first thousand years bright shining as the sun we've no less days to sing your praise than when we first begun when we've been there when we
we look upon your nail-pierced hands, the blood that you spilled, your broken body for me. We look upon your nail-pierced hands, the blood that you spilled, broken for me, you broke it for me. And I have been redeemed by the precious blood of the Lamb. I have been set free. No more bondage, no more shackles, no more shame. I have been redeemed by the blood of the Lamb, by the blood of the Lamb. been there when we've been there ten thousand years bright shine we long for the day God less days to sing your praise than when we first God, when we've been there, when we down on me yeah. and hallelujah all my stains are washed away and hallelujah grace like a rain falls down on me yeah. and hallelujah all my stains are washed away sing hallelujah like a rain falls down on me yeah. and hallelujah all my stains are washed away yeah. and hallelujah grace like a rain falls down on me Great. 
face like a ray falls down on me and hallelujah all my states washed away hallelujah grace like a rain falls down on me and hallelujah all my states are washed away they're 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 washed away keep singing they're washed away Washed away, the washed away, the washed away, the washed away, washed away, washed away, washed away, washed away, washed away, the washed away, the washed away, the washed away. We declare tonight, washed away, washed by the blood of the Lamb. From the west Those who look to the Lord are radiant And he says I long, I long to see your face To hear your voice Because you are clean And I have given you garments, new garments And I give you beauty, beauty for ashes Beauty, beauty for ashes Lift up your eyes No more distractions Not to the left or not to the right Or what others think about you Because there's only one eye the eyes of the Lord search to and fro throughout the earth, even now, even now. And he's gazing over the balcony of heaven. And he says, look, look, lift up your eyes, for you are beautiful, you are beautiful. I long to see your face. 
and hear your voice. Oh, my beloved, my beloved. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with just one glance of your eyes. You have my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with a look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes You have ravished my heart My sister, my bride With one look from your eyes You have ravished my heart My sister, my bride With one look from your eyes You have ravished my heart My sister, my bride With one look from your eyes You have ravished my heart Sister, my, my bride, bride, one look from your eyes. eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. You have ravished my heart, my sister, my bride, with one look from your eyes. Give me eyes for only you, God. Where nothing else satisfies in this world, God. Give me eyes for only you, God. When this world will fade, fade away. Be my magnificent obsession. When I awake, be the first thing on my mind. Give me eyes for only you, God. Doves are only you. For only you. Give me eyes for only you. For only you. I just invite everyone, even now, just to close your eyes and know that it's your voice that's ascending right now before the throne and that the Lord is singing over you, even now breaking shame and breaking guilt and condemnation and the lies that we believe even if we don't confess them with our mouth but we feel it day to day and let him just sing over you and lift up your voice to the Lord because it's not my voice or anybody else's voice that he just longs to hear it's your voice that ascends before the throne and he hears your voice and he says that it is beautiful that he longs to hear your voice and see your face. And even if you need to open your Bibles and sing your favorite verse to the Lord because you don't know what to say, just open up the word and sing the simplicity of just reading, singing the word. Because corporately, I want to go to the throne room together where it's not spectators, 
but it's literally all of our voices in one accord ascending to the throne and knowing that our voices shake heaven and change the atmosphere, not only in this room, but in this city and in the nations, that we can move heaven. God, we thank you for the dignity and the calling that our voices can shift the atmosphere and change regions when we sing of how great and how beautiful you are. We say we love you, Jesus. You are beautiful and glorious. No one is like you. No one is like you, Jesus. Shining like the sun in all of your glory, God. Chief among 10,000, you are brighter than the sun. You are. Lift up your voice, we say we love you, Jesus. One voice before the throne. We believe you, God. We believe that our voice changes the atmosphere. We ascend before the throne of grace.
And we do not know him Behold God is great Who can number his years He's so much bigger Than any image I've made in my head He's so much greater Than any storybook I've read Yeah is great and we do not know him behold God is great who can number his years he's so much bigger any image I made in my head is so much greater than any storybook I've read and who is this who sits above the circle of the earth and who is this who stretches out the heavens like a curtain who is this who measures the waters in the hollow of his hand who is this and who is this who stretches out the heavens Who measures the waters in the hollow of his hand? Yeah, yeah. So lift up your eyes to the heavens and behold your God. Lift up. Yeah.
He's so much you bigger than small than my eyes. He's gone. so much greater my than vision higher and higher. He's so much bigger than. He's so much greater than. He's so much bigger than. The arm of the Lord is He's not too so short much that it cannot say. He's so that it cannot deliver. He's so much greater than. Nothing is impossible with God. He's so much bigger than. He's so He raises up kings and he tears them down. He tears them down. He's so much greater than. Nothing is impossible with you, God. bigger than. He's nothing is impossible with you, God. He's so my circumstances. He's so much this seemed impossible to me. He's so much bigger than. Because I have a God who fights for me. A God who will deliver me. And nothing is impossible with you, God. Nothing is impossible with you, God. We look to the one even now seated on the throne, high above my circumstances, even now, where it may seem impossible, I say with him, nothing is impossible with you, God, nothing is impossible with you, all the nations are but a drop in the bucket, have you not heard, do you not know? He's the one from everlasting. He neither faints nor grows weary. He neither faints nor grows weary. He is not forgotten. You are not forsaken. You are not alone, not alone. to fight this battle on your own. Say you are not alone to fight this battle on your own. No, no. I have a God who fights for me. It is God who delivers me. And I have a God who fights for me. It is God who avenges me. And I have a God who fights for me. It is God who delivers me. tribulations, famine and sword. Nothing shall separate me from your love. Neither death shall separate me. Shall tribulation, perils, darkness. What shall separate me from your love, from your love?
Jesus, I just ask that you would seal this on our hearts. God, that you would, in each heart in this room, in each individual, that you would open up all of our eyes to see you rightly. And God, that you would show us that we are not alone, that we are not forgotten, and that nothing can separate us from your love. And that even right now you're fighting for the destinies and every word that you've spoken over the men and women in this room. God, I ask that you would, every word spoke over and every prophecy given over each individual lives, God, that when the enemy has came in to bring disappointment and where some have lost heart, God, I ask that you would come and fight for us and that you would restore vision and that we would dare to believe again and dare to reach again. In Jesus' name.